It's time now for your science buzz. Stories making a little bit of a buzz in the world of science this week. We're going to start off with a gigantic blob of seaweed headed for Florida and other tourist hotspots. These clumps of seaweed are actually visible from space, and this is known as sargassum. The seaweed is not one giant mass, but rather a slew of teardrop shaped blobs that stretch over 60 miles in the Atlantic Ocean. Now, most of the seaweed is still hundreds of miles from the US, but some is already washed up on beaches in the state of Florida. If too much of it comes on shore, it can overwhelm the beaches, rot on the sand, which smells and give off that rotten egg smell. It can also irritate your nose and lungs. All right, there is new rumblings about our closest planetary neighbor. Scientists have discovered evidence of volcanic activity on the planet Venus. They've been picking up and studying these pictures captured in the 1990s and spotted there was a volcanic vent. They say it changed shape, got much bigger over the span of eight months. Venus is similar in both size and composition is sometimes referred to as Earth's twin. All right, you know those long necks in the movie Land Before Time? Well, paleontologists say that they've identified the longest necked member of Littlefoot's family. This is the plant eating sauropod. It has a neck that could extend 10 feet, past, uh, 10 feet rather past a school bus to nearly 50 feet long. That could be a record holder. Experts say the animal's bones are hollow like that of a bird, and that probably helped it support its long neck. Paleontologists believe the dinosaur lived in what's now referred to uh, the area now in China some 162 million years ago.